Well, we're in the home stretch. Less than three months left until the first event held here at Globe Life Field, the brand new home of the Rangers. And today they let us in for a peek at the progress and also at their holiday celebration. As the 1600 men and women behind Globe Life Field's construction got a holiday lunch. I just want to welcome you guys all here. And a hello from some of the Rangers themselves. We got a look inside the new stadium that's expected to open this March. If I leave the building even mid morning or by midday, things change. Uh, it's moving that fast. That progress seemed at risk last Saturday after a fire broke out in the subroof on the third baseline caused by sparks from a welder. No one was injured, but images of the flames and smoke had a lot of us, even some of the Rangers, concerned. <laughs> I was kind of scared for a little bit because I was like, oh man, I hope that doesn't delay the process. But Wednesday, Manhattan construction ensured there'd be no delay. At all. Doesn't affect it at all. And they've had some safety education moments since the fire. And we'll have the brand new roof put back in within a couple of weeks uh, by the first of the year, pretty much. Now the focus is on the field. I mean, the sun shining in, the glass windows, like everything. It, it, it looks awesome. The fans and the future. You know, obviously it's going to be exciting just with the new ballpark. So there's going to be a lot of fans that are going to come out and just check the ballpark out. But we want to provide them with a, a championship, you know, team on the field. In Arlington, I'm Lauren Zakalik.